it was contracted by one of our Aboriginal artists, uh, Kim Wormsley, to um, paint something for this very long hallway corridor that we have in the hospital. It was part of our Darling Downs Hospital and Health Service Toowoomba Hospital Art Project that we had um, in the last financial year. It's about um, 30 metres long and it has a significant healing properties because it depicts some of the Gumby Gumby plants as well as the rainbow um, serpent which is part and parcel of our healing process. Well the Darling Downs Hospital and Health Service at Toowoomba Hospital are very supportive of closing the gap in uh, Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander health. The artwork shows a very welcoming feeling for people when they come in. It a lot of people look around the hospital, come into the hospital and they don't know where certain units are. The carpet snake heads towards an area of the renal and the rehabilitation unit. So if anyone gets lost and is looking for that unit, we just say, look for the head of the snake and it'll point you in that direction. We had in our art project, the Toowoomba Hospital Art Project, we had quite, contracted quite a few local artists. We have ward signs in MU1 and surgical ward. We have lamp posts done out in front of Fountain House. There's some large murals out in the front of the hospital um, outside of Yanara. In the orthopaedics unit, we also have some artwork on the wall as well. And there are a few pieces around the AMHU unit. Toowoomba Hospital is committed to closing the gap in Aboriginal health, so um, a lot of our visitors who come here and, and um, a lot of our patients who come through the hospital can feel, see the artwork as they enter and they just feel a little bit more welcome uh, noticing that around.